What's up everyone, my name is Nightro and today I'm gonna be playing Overlord Dark Legend now. I decided to play this because recently I've been watching some some let's plays, well not let's plays and only like some parts of it of Overlord and I got really nostalgic so I decided to play this. Now my favorite is mostly the first and second game. The third one is a little bit there but you know I wanted to play it since I finished playing a Copara Extra. So I decided to play a uh, console game instead of a visual novel, novel game. So yeah, and here we are. So let's go ahead and start the game. It's been a long time since I played an Overlord game. Ever since, now that I think about it, the only reason I got nostalgic with Overlord is because I was watching the an uh, the Overlord anime, and then I decided to look up is to see if there's, a, if there's an actual game of it, and there was. Holy shit. There is an Overlord game, but it's for the phone and it still isn't out yet. And then I looked up and saw that I have completely forgot about the last Overlord game that came out, which is for, I think, PS4 and PC. Now, I never played it and I was a bit disappointed to see how the game turned out, considering that's like, that is basically a top-down multiplayer game. And you play as different overlords. And I was really disappointed when I saw that, but you know, what can you do? Either way, let's go ahead and start this game because I'm really excited. Uh this I only played this game only once, which is funny. Well the other games I actually played them multiple times. I don't think I I don't even know if there's like different endings for this game. Also, uh, I ju I just finished live streaming Spyro 3 I mean not completely I'm only like halfway there but when I was checking you know what I'm just gonna shut up in Castle Grumgard a young lord was born I remember it well you will have a life full of questions young master but I know what is in your blood and on your 16th birthday you will have your answers Evil always finds a way, you know. <laughs> As the years went by, troubles emerged for Castle Gromgard. The surrounding lands became blighted. The crops died. Halflings stole from the villages. Bandits and wolves terrorized the countryside. The young lord's father, Duke Gromgard, embarked on an epic quest to foreign parts. One which would restore the fortunes of his land. But in his absence, Duchess Cromgard ran away with a strong, rich nobleman from a neighboring realm. <laughs> Floozy. To make matters worse, the Duke's quest proved fruitless. He returned disgraced, without a fortune and without a wife. Poor old devil. And then one day, on the young lord's 16th birthday, his father, broken-hearted and consumed by his obsession to restore glory to Gromgard, set out on another quest to save the land, leaving him alone with his rather unpleasant older siblings, Lord Grenville and Lady Gerda. This is the tale of what happened next. And we start the game now. So, oh yeah, I was saying that I just finished and, rec and live streaming sp and the Spiral 3 from the Spiral of Young Adat trilogy. And when I finished, like the other part of that, of the fourth part, because at the beginning, uh, my live stream ended up crashing, like after an hour. And after an hour. The freaking the freaking inter my PS4 got disconnected from the internet, so I, uh, basically the basically the PS4 live stream ended up crashing, so I had to restart it from where from where I was. And when I got back, well, when I finished it, the second part, the fourth part, it turns out the fucking I don't know if it's like that's a, it's right now or I just have to wait a little bit more until it finishes, but. 
for some reason it says uh, it was 15 minutes long when it's not supposed to be 15 minutes long it's supposed to be four hours long which it, I'm, I'm a bit concerned and pissed off so I'm hoping that it's like an error at the moment until a couple of minutes later it will be probably fixed I'm off out. I'm not babysitting while you swan off to see your spineless, pointy-eared friends. I mean, business in the Golden Hills. The runt can look after himself. Well, fine. Looks like you're on your own, little brother. Do try to mutilate yourself horribly. Another thing about this game is... Well, what are I... Like I was saying earlier, that... Uh... Okay, let me draw like in the kitchen. I don't remember what it was. Okay. You better come down to the kitchen, young lord. Our birthday present has arrived yes. for you. Now I'm hoping that was there's an error at the moment until a couple of minutes has passed. Hopefully we'll say like it's later on four hours years. four hours of the live stream. Because I literally I'm already at the third row. And I'm getting close to beating the game and I don't want like all that progress. Like for nothing. Well, not for nothing because I was I was still having fun. But you know, I, I was I, I wanted to do a full live stream on it and because of that bullshit. I don't want the whole progress to be lost during the live stream. So yeah, that's all I had to say about that. Now another thing is that in my I mean some people said that this is just a spin-off, but in my opinion I think this is more for me I see it more as a prequel. Because in this game you start off as a teenage overlord, which is funny because in the first and second game. I mean the first one you start as an adult and then later on you in the second game you play as that overlord son. But at the beginning, you t in, the, in the tutorial, you start as the second overlord, as a little kid, but then over time, you end up <laughs> playing as the adult version of that overlord, which is a, a really cool. Now personally, I think I like the, f the second game a lot more, mostly because... <laughs> mostly because... Oh shit. Mostly because, like, your, like your minions, they can literally ride wolves, and I mean, it's just more helpful having wolves with you. Plus, you look a lot more buffier and stuff like that, and it has a different ending too. Like two completely different endings, depending on which one, which side you pick, good or evil. And it doesn't end well. Not that I think of it. Maybe there, there might be a secret ending to that game. Probably I don't know. Dark and dank aroma, for that is the smell of evil, and it is in your blood, Lord Kramgard. I have been expecting you for a very long time. I've been having a little snooze since your christening, uh, and a little snack. I am now your advisor and devoted servant of darkness. Your armor certainly suits you, master. Disguise is all that nasty human skin of yours. Now, I admit this place has seen better days, but all it needs is a splash of new evil to really darken the place up. Okay. Now your brother and sister have left, it's time for you to take Castle Grumgard for yourself. I suggest so yeah, I, I don't know. If the second game has a secret ending or not, because I remember that when I was watching a, a gameplay video of the last Overlord game that came out, the the character Narl, I think it was called, I think that was his name, he said that the second Overlord, he died in a tragic way, even though I do not remember him dying at all, which is weird. So yeah. It's really weird the fact that he said that the that that specific overlord died, even though in the end of the game you actually are still alive with all of your mistresses. Destroy everything. Now you may continue to break some other things if you wish, but I have some friends who can't wait to My minions! 
I'm gonna continue destroying the more because that bitch deserved to get her stuff right. She's a terrible person even though if I remember correctly I think we get we kill her along with her boyfriend. Man that is some Ugh. Some ugly ass decoration. What kind of oh that must be that must be his boyfriend question mark? Can't even destroy it. Oh man, can't destroy that. Well, either way, I'm, I'm pretty sure that eventually I'll play the first game Control on my channel, like a full let's play on it. Don't you start whittling. These are your brown minions. Not much to look at, but loyal fighters that'll bash whatever you wish, side. Okay, that was weird. I think the cutscene got skipped or something? Or maybe it was supposed to be like that, I don't remember. Call them to you, sire. How they flock to you. Stupidity really is bleak. I'm guessing the beam of them will now just send them the up somewhere. I was right. <laughs> Sweep the minions across the ground towards your brother's beloved baubles. Minions love destruction and will smash anything they can get their little claws on. Well done, Master. You're a I mean, that's a bit of a slow, like, controlling it, I don't know. Destroy everything, my minions! I'm guessing there's a halfling infestation, so let's go down. murder them. I kinda wish we could just run faster, but you know, whatever. Halflings! And it's, I find it kinda funny because I'm pretty sure that in the first game, the whole bosses you fight, I find that that, I'm pretty sure that's like a reference to to the Lord of the Rings movie, like a parody in a way, I guess. Time to defend your castle and show those tubby devils who's in charge around here. Kill them. <laughs> Thank you. I have murdered them all. Let's continue. Man, this is this feels really weird just to control because I'm more I'm since I got used to playing on my PS4 and everything is really weird. Well, that halfling is there. Oh, that's a picture of me. Well, picture of the Overlord. Give me the gold. Now, I don't even remember ever using gold in this game, but I do remember using it in the other ones. Because in the other ones, you can actually upgrade your castle and all that stuff. But in this, in this game, I'm not even sure. Watch them, sire. They're feisty and riled. Yes, my minion, grab weapons and kill them all. Quick! Run! Flame! And they're butt ugly. <laughs> Follow those pot bellied pests, sire, and make them pay. I will let this destroy my horn and invade in my castle, I guess. Even though it doesn't belong to me just yet. What does it say there? I only have two with me. Well, that explains. Destroy the halflings! They must be destroyed! Ah, the halflings have closed the castle gates! We need more minions to operate that wheel and open them. To summon more minions. 
means you'll need to collect life force, Dark Master. Those beetles over there are scuttling sources of need the life force, force. Right for the harvesting. Just give them a good bashing. They love it, really. For you. No, another thing I remember is I think there's another mechanic where you can just grab the neck of one of the minions and shake them up. And you just, even if you shake them up long enough, they will eventually explode. I think that's that how it works, but I don't mean, I don't think they have teach me. I don't think they haven't even teach me how to do that just yet. Are they all the Lord? Excellent! You're a quick learner, sire. Oh, it's so much nicer when they have a brain. Which is kind of weird because you're also a minion. Now, and I find it weird that you, uh, that you actually have a brain. To, open the port gate. to even like, talk like that and all that shit. You can never have enough freaking life force. For you. Let's go my minions! Let's kill them! I don't think I don't even know if this is, if you can get better armor in this game. I have to look up if if this is an actual like prequel or not, or maybe just a span of because In my opinion, like I said before, that for me, I think this is like a prequel. Oh no, the chef is stuck. But I killed the halfling. There's not supposed to be any halflings, you down, chef. Do you love that uh, the oven on? You, you, you freaking goof. You must save the castle from the fires. Heat cooks brown minions, so you'll need the reds to put out the flames. Unfortunately, the red minion hive is missing. I think those blasted halflings have something to do with it. Quickly! I'm hiding in a cupboard, and it's getting a little toasty. No ah, happening in real standing there. Sabotage our castle, uh, your castle. I mean, your castle, sire. <laughs> That's mine. Kill them! Kill them, my minions! They don't deserve to live. Here's a gateway. Drat! It seems the fire in the castle is disrupting the waypoint gate. You won't be able to teleport your dark magnificence back in until you retrieve the red hive. Damn pumpkins lying around all day being orange. <laughs> what the fuck? A merry clink of gold coins, Lord. They always come in handy. And you have a pumpkin head. Kill them. You must destroy everything. Give me that gold. Oh, what the heck? Can I kill them from here? No. That's annoying, but whatever. Let's just continue with our overlord of deals some shit. Foolish halflings have tried to block your path. Block you. How can they even block? They're so fucking freaking pathetic. and push it out of the way. Danger! You'll see danger now, you fools. Let's continue with our... I don't know. Ooh, spells. Quick! Why you fucking let him in getting fucking hit you? Ah, lovely, lovely relics. 
so well, at least now I can use spells. You'll need to take any you find to a waypoint gate. Don't worry, your minions will automatically carry relics to the nearest gate. Die, you halflings! Okay. Sire, you now have the power of the energy spike spell. Use it to teach those halflings what to be afraid of. No, my one minion died. <gasps> no. Minions! Murder them! Can't even go up. Here. I should have waited for everyone else <laughs> instead of just winning, bringing and attack them and getting one of my minions killed. Are starting to melt, sire. I don't care or no. not. <laughs> you can't get your damn freaking melts. You can melt it or whatever. Destroy! Destroy! Silly. And now uh, you get in. Or not? I don't know. And you burn your feet. What was the point of getting a damn basket? Either way. Let's see. Okay, I think it's stuff it's time for me to stop recording. Blah 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 because it's getting kinda late. Well not late, but you know like I've been recording for too long. I don't want the video to be as long. So yeah. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this let's play that I'm starting, even though I'm not even sure how well it will do, but whatever, I'm just gonna have fun. Can I destroy this? I guess I can, probably. Never mind. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We're gonna continue recording some more. Hopefully, I, I don't think this video is, I don't think this let's play is gonna be as long. But whatever. So guys, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it, and let's see you in the next one. Peace.